I'm home! Hey. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Nora, right, right? Nora. Happy holidays, Josh. Christmas isn't Christmas without Hallmark, right? So why do you think people just love Hallmark holiday movies and shows so much? For me anyway, like it puts me in the mindset of wanting to see the world and, and, and as a result, my life, the way that it could be. Like I want the best possible version. It's like the optimism and the possibility to like jump from the reflection of the challenges of the year into like, but let's start the new year. Like, we really like can't. a Hallmark movie. Yeah, I think it sets the tone. It sets the mood. It reminds people to like express your love and and it, it's safe and fun for everybody. It's the way we all start, the countdown to Christmas. I mean, as soon as these movies start coming on, it puts you in the mood. And we all want a little like, a little love and a little joy and a little sparkle around the hol holidays. And Hallmark gives us that without question every year. This is a disaster. Fully grown adults living in fear of a tiny old woman. Does that sound about right? Tiny but powerful. I mean, and you guys in the holidays, I mean, there's a lot of chaos that happens around the holidays too. This show in particular really shows us our world, like the chaos, the drama, the love, the good times, the bad times, the messes, the failures, the mm -hmm. success, all of all of the emotion that we feel at the holidays with our own families is packed into this and it's packed into this cast. Yeah. And this cast love each other and we disagree like family members because we always know that we're always gonna love each other. This is a cast that loves each other very much. Did your wife put you up to this? Yes. You? Oh, yeah. <laughs> what has been your guys' favorite part about being part of Holidays, the cast, and oh, oh, this. Aww. I didn't even have right there. the question, and it's like, already I'm filling the love. There's 35 of us, right, in the main cast. And so if you went out into the street and you grabbed 35 people at random who didn't know each other, and you stuck them in the living room of a house and you went away and you came back an hour later, the likelihood that what you're gonna find is everyone laughing, paired off into intense, beautiful conversations, like just like talking to each other as if they'd known each other their whole lives, that's not gonna happen. That's just not how it goes, right? That was our cast. It was a real collaboration too, with the writers, with the directors, and I think because we're exploring so many different types of stories, like they were always asking us like, so in this environment, we have a very different culture for Christmas. And so they were really asking us like, what kind of foods would you guys have here? What kind of like very culturally specific things? Like they're so open and collaborative in that sense. I've never really been part of a movie that was like so detailed on that and they really cared. Yeah. Um, so that was very fun. Love the smell of family dysfunction at the holidays. Merry Christmas, Merry Christmas.